Well, the 4th of July might look a bit different in one Pinellas County town this year. Treasure Island, they're enforcing some new rules for fireworks. And on your sides, Chloe Sparks live on Treasure Island now with what you need to know to celebrate the holiday. Good morning. Good morning. You can still watch the city's professional fireworks display from right here on the beach in Treasure Island. However, you won't be allowed to bring your own fireworks to the beach this 4th of July. Fireworks are losing some of their flair in Treasure Island. City leaders deciding to ban them from the beach this 4th of July. For safety reasons, one of the issues we found last year was folks were setting up mortars and Roman candles and explosive devices in great and real close proximity to other families and beachgoers. For displays that seem to get more dangerous every year, the city is enforcing a few ordinances to include fireworks before someone gets hurt. We were fortunate last year and did not have any serious fireworks related injuries on 4th of July. It's illegal for the city to ban fireworks because of a law DeSantis put into place a few years ago. So they're working around it. Fireworks are now considered an open flame, which is not allowed on the beach. Also, the debris from fireworks now goes against the city's leave no trace on the beach ordinance. The police department will be issuing warnings and if people continue, there will be a citation involved. Fireworks will also go against the city's coastal lighting standards because the light is not sea turtle friendly. While you can still light fireworks from your home, the city believes their public professional display on the beach is the safest option. And the city's professional fireworks display will begin at 9 here on the beach. You can park in the Gulf Front parking lot right off Gulf Boulevard. Reporting live in Treasure Island, Chloe Sparks, 8 on your side.